this will be a quick tutorial on putting in the uh, uh, shelf in the closet with the hangers. And I've made a, uh, a, uh, a family to do that automatically. And I've loaded that up to Blackboard so you can download that and just put that into your project. You don't have to make it. So component, uh, closet hanger on pole that's adjustable. And what that means is that we can drag it to the correct length. So uh, let's see if we can flip it. Yeah, okay, so there it is. I'm just gonna put it in there for right now. We'll grab that and we'll move it from here down to here and then we'll align it over here. So that's the shelf above the hanger, uh, the rod in the hanger. And then when you click on this object, you can drag it to whatever length you want it to be. So I want it to go to there. The hanger itself, I've copied from uh, or downloaded and, and uh, inserted into my uh, uh, adjustable shelf, but it's actually, the person that made it actually made it longer than it's supposed to be. So it shows that it's in the way of the door. Um, I've tried to modify it, but it's really a mess. So I just leave it like that. All right. So anyway, we're going to uh, mirror that about the midpoint. Well, let's see of the door. Let's see what happens when we do that. Yep. Okay. So now I've got my hanging in there. I can mirror that about the center of this wall and then uh, just drag it back. So I'll drag it back to where I want it to be. And as I said, this is available to you on Blackboard. You just download it and, and put it into your project. So now it's pretty clear what these rooms are. I'm going to come over here and do the same thing. Architecture component. And it's uh, backwards. So I hit the space bar and the space bar. And then try and put it up over here. I need to align it a little bit. The shelf would be back there. And then click on this guy and just drag him over. If we had an advanced Revit class, I would show you how to make this. Um, maybe we'll do it in the class if uh, there's time, but there's plenty of uh, things to do besides this. All right, so now we have a walk-in closet. You can see that I need to drag that a little bit farther. And we might put that also across this way uh, to get a little bit more hanging, but I'm not going to put that in there. Uh, well, I'll do one just to show you what I mean, but I think it would be better to have a sh like a shoe rack or something here at the end uh, than, than hanging across there again too. So uh, we'll come over here again, architecture component, and it's 100% backwards. So I'll pull it around like that and bring it over here. Now I need to align it again. And then you can see it needs to be adjusted. So what this is doing is it's adjusting not only the shelf, uh, but it's also adjusting the number of hangers that are there. I still need to drag that just a little bit more. Okay, and there we go. So now let's see if we have all the, we have the master bedroom walk-in closets for his and hers. You can guess which one is hers. Uh, we have the closet hanging over here, here, and here. So I think we're in good shape. Last thing I want to do is just put these double doors in. So architecture door, we're looking for the double doors. Remember those double doors have glass in them. So let's see if we go with uh, six feet wide. How does that look? Yeah, that looks fine. All right. And I'm looking at the dimensions. It looks like it's uh, centered. Uh, so that's it. That, that's uh, uh, everything we need to do in terms of the uh, closets now. So we're in good shape. I still have this linen closet. I need to do something there. So um, I guess we'll just put a door in real quick. 72 by 84 is not what I want. I want a single flush. Uh, 30, that's a small. We'll do 30 by 84 and I'm gonna swing it out so that it doesn't get in the way. So there'll be some kind of shelving or something in there. And this would be the linen closet for, for the entire 
uh, second floor. Sheets, pillowcases, pillows, um, blankets, maybe extra towels, uh, washcloths, things like that, uh, that that support the, the rest of the house. So we're looking pretty good here. I'm going to save it and stop the video here.